I would like to see web series that are uh, dealing with the format of a web presentation and making sense of it and, and trying to, um, to persuade you to stay you know, online with that program by offering something with, that's innovative, that's interesting and that has to do uh, something with, uh, with life and with the presentation of uh, that kind of life that you present. A web series that unites all these features Jan Distelmeyer mentions and would also have followed all the rules given to me in 2008 we discussed before is the original web series Web Therapy. Web Therapy starring Lisa Kutrow has been streamed since 2008 and consists of five seasons with about 15 to 18 episodes each. It equally offers short episodes a very limited range of characters in each episode, mostly even only two persons, and a strong hook. Part of the hook lies in Lisa Kudrow's fame due to her role as quirky Phoebe in Friends, maybe you have seen her, and her immense comedic acting and timing talent as web therapist Fiona Wallace. What for me made this hook a hold in the first minutes of the pilot episode is this main character, an unexpectedly uh, self-absorbed and uh, impatient therapist, Fiona Wallace uses iChat to host therapy sessions mostly due to being able to restrict the time and patient connection far better than in an actual practice or clinic environment. Each episode concentrates on one web session with a patient. However, Three consecutive episodes always deal with three sessions with one, just one, and the same patient. Jan Distelmeyer also explains another innovative piece of web therapy that forms a huge part of a possible hook, the show's self-referentiality. But what's so self-referential about web therapy? Well. The title, it's web therapy, it's about uh, therapy on the web, the video chat um, therapy, which is, so using uh, the web presentation, being part of the web presentation. It's showing the, the interface of uh, that, uh, that web chat in the beginning of the series. So um, it's, it's dealing with the, the presentation modus of um, its presentation models and the problems. I mean, if you have something uh, so intimate and um, important like, like a therapy session in a, in a video chat um, or in a video transmitting process on the web, that is something which is, um, I think it's, it's funny from the beginning. What is very interesting about web therapy, especially considering this self-referential attitude, is its current swap to TV. Starting out as a purely web screened series in 2008, that by the way can be watched freely on the site like linked here, uh, TV channel Showtime acquired the series for TV where it has been screened as a half hour sitcom since 2011. To achieve the half hour TV format, additional scenes were shot and included in each episode. This opens up a very interesting topic, the blurring of lines between web and TV formats that we see today. We have definitely arrived at an interesting question. When is an audiovisual series a web series? And when is it a TV series? Is the content defined by its broadcasting platform or instead does the platform lose its importance in the definition? HBO's Game of Thrones, for example, became Internet's most streamed series last year. Opposed to that, US Internet streaming platform Netflix has developed its first original series with House of Cards and Orange is the New Black that in their narratives and production value are no longer recognizable as made for web looking cheap or something, but completely equal dramatic and comedic TV serials. House of Cards, for example, features Kevin Spacey and Robin Wright Penn, well-respected Hollywood actors. Also, 
13 has been the first ever year in the history of US American Emmy Awards, the awards for best TV productions, that has seen a nomination for a web-only show for best drama series, with exactly this series, House of Cards. So does that mean the TV series is a web series now, or a web series is a TV series? Does the platform still matter? Why and how? Well, I'm interested in your opinion, so please discuss. <laughs>